Okay, so I've got another quick short one I do. Now, I'd like to have this option here. The bottom display panel, or we want to call it uh, detail panel, ribbon. And I've been exploring all different revenues. I've gone through the registry and so forth, trying to find folder options because I want this down the bottom. That's not how it looks in Windows 10, and I don't know what it looks like in Windows 11. I'm going to try and avoid 11 as long as I can. I've only just installed 10 because uh, I tried to avoid 10 as long as I could. Now I'm finding some programs won't install unless I have Windows 10 or better, so I needed to upgrade. So if you want that bottom status bar, detail bar like I did, um, detail pan, you know, I've left a few windows open so you can see I've been researching this, trying to find an answer to my solution, and th this seems to be a very popular topic that a lot of people have asked. I haven't really found an answer. Even the solution that I found today, um, I've been pe I've read people asking about it, but nothing about finding it. You know, other people advertising it, and then you've got all this here, how to make Windows 10 look like XP, but they don't include the bottom part of that um, detail bar. This one here, you know, post from 2013, and um, and he's showing that there, and that's how I found what I found today. You can actually download an old New Explorer, they call it, and so what it looks like is this. Now, if I was to untick this and this, and go, un well, sorry, I'll leave them both ticked and then go uninstall. Now I'll reopen that folder, or a folder, doesn't have to be that one. And now that that's uninstalled, it's back to the side here. Now I don't like that at all. So I like it down the bottom. I want all my files to be spread across the whole window. I don't want details down the side here. And uh, it tells me everything I need to know, but that's just ugly to me. I want it down the bottom nice and tidy. So I'll close that off. Come back over here. Turn them both back on. I'll get it uninstalled again. Turn them both back on. I like grey. You can leave it default white, but I like it grey so it really shines out. And um, then go install. And that's it. I already use Classic Shell, but Classic Shell doesn't fix that problem. So now if I go back to that, click a file, and it shows me all the details down the bottom instead of the side. Much better having it down there. So that's it. That's what I wanted to show you. Is, um, I've done a couple of days research trying to find a solution, and that's the best solution I can find. So I know I'm late in the game with Windows 10, but it still seems to be something that nobody's found an answer to. So... Well, somebody did find an answer to, obviously, but it's not advertised well enough for others doing research that they're trying to find the same thing to actually find the solution. So I'm hoping that this video helps others find a solution. Okay, well, thanks for watching. Like always, I appreciate you, and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.